I'm not a lawyer, but let's hear what ChatGPT has to say about Elon Musk's lawsuit against OpenAI. The document is a legal complaint about a company called OpenAI. The person who filed it, probably Elon Musk, is upset because he believes OpenAI is not sticking to its original promises. Here's what's going on. One, original promises. OpenAI was supposed to be a company that worked for the good of everyone, sharing its AI technology freely and not trying to make money from it. They wanted to create super smart AI that would help people, not just a few rich folks or big companies. Two, broken promises. The complaint says OpenAI has changed and is not following its original goals. It's accused of keeping its AI technology to itself, making deals that benefit only a few, and working too closely with Microsoft, a very big tech company. Three legal problems. The document lists several ways OpenAI is said to have broken its promises, like not sharing its AI tech freely, letting Microsoft have too much control, and using its resources for profit, which wasn't the plan at the start. Four what they want. The person who complained is asking the court to make OpenAI stick to its original promises. This includes making sure OpenAI's technology is shared with everyone, confirming that their new AI, like GPT-4 and something called Q, should be free from Microsoft's control, and possibly giving back money if it was used wrongly. Five, big picture. The big worry is that OpenAI is moving away from its mission to help everyone with its AI technology, and is instead focusing on making money and benefiting only a few people, which wasn't what was intended when it was first set up. The complaint is like telling a teacher that a group project team isn't sticking to the plan you all agreed on, and now it's not fair, so you're asking for help to fix things. The person complaining wants to make sure that the AI technology OpenAI creates is used to help everyone, not just to make some people richer. So, what do you think? Do you think that this is a good interpretation of the lawsuit? Let me know in the comments. Also, don't forget to follow me on Twitch at Coding Things in Real Life and subscribe to my YouTube channel at Coding Things in Real Life.